The protest movements of the 1970s, born out of frustration over the Vietnam War, gave birth to militant activists fighting for feminism, free speech, the environment, and against racism. Out of this era rose Angela Davis, a one-time member of the Black Panther Party, the vice presidential nominee of the Communist Party USA, who was charged with conspiracy to murder but later acquitted regarding a shooting at Marin County that landed her on the FBI's most wanted list, an image that made her an icon. Angela Davis was a pioneer. I mean, I call her what she is. She's a pioneer. She was somebody who was right there at the beginning. She's a, 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 a voice that needs to be heard from. And this controversial figure is speaking at College of the Canyons, part of the anti-racism speaker series called An Afternoon with Dr. Angela Davis. And per campus administrators, the event is intended to bring a diverse voice to the campus to inspire others to get involved in the community and learn to speak out. I think it's important, uh, particularly in a, in a community like this, that we celebrate the diversity that we do have. But there are those in this very community who see Dr. Davis in a whole different light. Well, she's a, a radical activist, uh, left-wing Marxist. With one-sided political speech on college campuses being a part of the growing political culture war raging across the country, it is no difference here, as the absence of an opposition voice for future events has fueled claims of bias. I understand that the college wanted to put on a series of seminars on anti-racism, which we applaud, but our belief is they should be doing it from all different sides of the spectrum. And if they wanted to put a left-wing person in there, a progressive person, there are dozens of others they could have selected from without the checkered background she has. Regardless of the differing opinions, the event will go on. It's a sold-out event and will be held this coming Saturday at 3 p.m. at the PAC. For Canyons News, I'm Jeff Lozick.